Hello Scorpio, how are you? This is your daily tarot card reading, it's for the end of the week, Thursday, Friday. So, let's go into the energy, let's see what message we get for Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, for the end of the week. Okay. Right, you're making a decision, um, something hasn't been working the way you wanted it to, okay? Something hasn't been providing you, it's either a person or a job or a situation, hasn't been providing you with the connection or the stability you would have liked. So you're making a decision to let go of it. Um, it's been driving you crazy, Page of Pentacles reversed. I mean, Jesus, you know, this whole situation's been driving you crazy, driving you nuts. Um, you just need, you just need to just like, boom, move on. And you've got here the Knight of Swords energy. I just feel, Scorpio, you're going to be cutting through the bullshit and you're just going to be like very, very clear where it is you're going, how you're doing it, what you're doing. And um, you're not going to allow anybody to drive you mentally crazy anymore. You know, it's like this is, it's going to be done your way or the highway. And you're supported by your spirit guides to just be very, very clear with people. Uh, this could have been pertaining to an X, by the way, because I do get the Knight of Swords as an X. Um, now you've got King of Wands energy here for the person you're attracted to. This person is very, uh, <laughs> they've got quite a masculine energy. So even though, I mean, this person doesn't have to be a man, right? But they've got strong masculine energy and it's a very fiery energy. It's very creative. They're quite unpredictable. They like taking risks. Um, and, um, you know, yeah, what can I say? Uh, quite an quite a lovable character as well. That's the thing about them. Very attractive energy. Um, so you've got that kind of person in your life, and um, you know the thing with King of Swords energy, uh, King of Wands energy. You cannot change this person. I'm telling you now. There's, you just can never change this person. But they're lovable. <laughs> you've got here the card surrender. At times we must surrender the old before something new can enter our lives. Let go and it will all work out. Yeah, like I said, I think you're letting go, Scorpio, of whatever it was that was driving you nuts. And you're taking the control back and you're saying, no more, can't roll on the way we were. Um, <laughs> and it's just a case of you probably having to be the stronger person. Um, you know, and it's, it's interesting. I think... You know, at times this person you're connected to really triggers you. Um, but then you trigger them as well. <laughs> you're both strong characters. This is the thing. Your spirit guides are supporting you with your sensitive nature. Okay? <laughs> so cute. Um, you are supported. You're not alone. You're supported by your spirit guides. Um, to be sensitive to yourself. Alright? Because you've got to do things in the way that are right for you. And um, this is now, you're going to get a lot more clearer. You could be communicating with somebody and just telling them how it is, basically, you know. Um, and it is about letting go of something that hasn't been working out. Um, because you've got, to, you've got to sort of really look after yourself. You know, you can't look after everyone else all of the time. Okay, so that's the message, Scorpio. If you do like it, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe. If you'd like a one-to-one -one tarot, do email me or contact me. And I'm sending you lots of love and peace for your Thursday and your Christmas Eve.